Brother Umar says, if one passes wind while making wudu, do they carry on with their wudu or do they have to redo from the beginning? Brother Umar, wudu is like prayer. The end of it is connected to the beginning. And it's a whole unit that cannot be interrupted. So if you perform wudu and you wash your face, your arms to the elbows, you wipe your head and your ears, and you wash your right foot, and while you are about to wash your left foot, you pass wind. This means that you have to start from the very beginning, which is washing the face because your wudu was invalid. Likewise, if you're praying two units and you finish the first unit well, the second unit well, you're in tashahud, as you are reciting the salutation, you passed wind. Your prayer is over. You have to perform wudu and go pray these two units all over again. So this is something that are connected to one another. Unlike charity, for example, if you give a hundred dollars in charity. So you give ten dollars to this poor person, ten dollars to this poor person. By the time you reach the tenth person and you wanted to give ten dollars, your intention changed. And now you want to boast about it and you want to show off with this ten dollars. Would I say that the ninety dollars, the previous ones, are all down the drain? No. These are not connected. These are separate incidents and separate form, uh, forms of worship, unlike wudu or uh, salat, and Allah Azza wa knows best.